Software Spring Presence How to use XMatch and Index, together, in Google Sheets Hello folks, greetings. Welcome to this tutorial, on using XMatch and Index functions together. This tutorial gives steps, to create a drop-down menu of products, and get price of a product, selected from menu. Here is the content of this tutorial. Overview of setup of spreadsheets. Overview of XMatch and Index functions. Overview of XMatch and Index function formulas. Objective of using XMatch and Index together. Overview of setup of spreadsheets. There are two sheets in this spreadsheet, titled product data, and product price. Product data has product ID, product, and price data. Okay, let's look at the product price sheet. This sheet has product, and price columns. We will create a drop-down menu here, and get the price, of a selected menu item here, using Smatch, and Index Functions Combo Formula. Overview of XMatch and Index Functions XMatch returns position of specified search key, in specified row, or column. Index returns data in cell, offset by specified rows, and or columns, from first cell of specified range. Overview of XMatch and Index Function Formulas Search key, is the data, XMatch searches in the lookup range. Lookup range, is a row or column, which may have the search key. Match mode, and search mode, are optional. For more info on XMatch formula, please review the tutorial, How to use XMatch in Google Sheets, whose link is given in the description. Reference, is a range. Index will offset specified rows, and or columns, from the first cell of the range. Row, is the number of rows, to offset from the first cell of the range. Column, is the number of columns, to offset from the first cell of the range. Objective of using XMatch, and Index together. To create a drop-down menu of products. To get price of selected product, from drop-down menu, by nesting XMatch inside index. Ok, let's switch to the product data sheet, and get started. Sort the data range. Key point. Sorting data, assists to select items, from pull-down menu, by typing only first few characters of product name. First, select the entire data range. To select an entire data range, select first row of data. Then, press and hold shift and control keys, and press down arrow key, as many times, till last row is selected. Click data. Hover over sort range, and select advanced range sorting options. Select column B, to sort by column B, and click sort. D select, and navigate to the top portion of the spreadsheet. Tip. To navigate to top portion of spreadsheet, press and hold control key, and press up arrow key, as many times, till first row displays. Name the data range. Select the entire data range, as before. Click name box. Type a name, for example, product database, and press enter. Deselect, and use the step as before, to 
to navigate to the top portion of the spreadsheet. Name the product column. First, select the entire column, starting from cell B3. Repeat the steps to name a range, and type a name, for example, product list. Create drop-down menu, in product price sheet. Click product price. Click this cell. Click insert. Click drop-down. Click criteria field, and select drop-down from range. Click select data range. Click the down arrow. Select product list, and click OK. Switch to product price sheet again. Let me close this pane. Click this cell, to display the drop-down menu items. Select an item. Get price of selected item, using X match and index. Click this cell. Type the equal to symbol, and type I and E, and select index. For reference, type P, and select product database, and type comma. For row, let's nest the X match function. Type X, M, and select X match. For search key, click this cell. Type comma. For lookup range, type P, and select product list. Type the closing parenthesis, to end the X match part of the formula, and type comma. For column, type 3 because price is in the third column of product data sheet. Type the closing parenthesis, to end the index function formula. Press enter. There you go. The X match index function combo formula, has returned the price of the selected item. Click this cell, and select another item. Alright, the price of the selected item is displayed. Quick review. The X match index functions combo formula, used in this tutorial is X match returns position of search key, in lookup range Index returns cell value, at intersection of position, and specified column That's it folks. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel.